Our breakthrough is to develop materials allows to fabricate this kind of flexible sensors to achieve high sensitivity, stability, and also for long-term monitoring. Because current device is kind of rigid, cannot be bent, cannot conform to the dynamic nature of the human tissue or human organ. My technology has allowed us to get this kind of biological signal from forearm muscle signals, which is used to control the prosthetics and help our stroke patient to recover the sense capability. We also extend human capability in a way now we can develop some kind of flexible sensors to communicate with plants. So this is the way it allows us to precisely control plant behavior and also can use the plant as a living sensor even for agriculture monitoring. I believe this technology development will be help our national needs, especially increase our food security to help Singapore to develop next generation healthcare technology. In Singapore, I strongly believe our research is not only focused on the Nobel Prize. We need to think about how we can really translate our research, our know-how to meet our local needs. For me, the secret to success in R&D is PhD, passion, hardworking, and determination. The most rewarding for me is we train a group of high-quality students to be best, to be global competitive. I really enjoy the Singapore ecosystem. This has allowed me to feel, to try, and learn to put Singapore on a global map. I have been recruited by many top universities, but I cannot find a reason to live here. You cannot find a second place like Singapore to do research. This is what makes me who I am today.